Hi, what's up, y'all? It's popping into D. About to react to this vid. This is New York carrying Flavor of Love. Uh, she definitely carried this show. Whenever I think of Flavor of Love, I immediately think of her. Um, so yeah, let's see what she does in this vid. Let's watch. Yo, Comes this bitch New York from last season. Oh, he brought her back two back. seasons? Enjoy my guests. brought her back a second. Feel comfortable. You guys better. Shit. Who the fuck with me? I'm not impressed at all. But you know, he wouldn't have to have gone through this if he picked me over that slut Kelly. Oh, delicious. If you're delicious, let that ass pop outside of that dress like that. I don't want this glass. Let's see you pour me a fresh glass because I don't know you well. Let's, you know. How are you ladies feeling with me here? Do you feel? I'm not that excited to see you. Nor you shouldn't be. Because you're just another girl to slob my man down. Ooh, you're mad. Yeah. You're a dreamer. You dream a lot in your sleep. No, not really. I'm not. Yes, you do. No, I Yes, don't. you do. I speak my mind like I said, and I tell it how Everyone it is. Everyone speaks their fucking mind. Where do you think they can no, get no, 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 I just want to say that <laughs> I'm back. I feel sorry for these girls. You upstairs, you are so fucking caught up in some shit. Come downstairs, just smack me right across the fucking face because this is just disrespectful. Get your ass in line and shut your mouth. New York, you're not gonna walk over there? there? Nope. You're not gonna walk over there? You're out of it. You look like a fairy princess that resides over the pits of hell. <laughs> I deserve an apology. When I came down those stairs, you did not address You're me not right. getting one. I Period. don't apologize because I never make, you know, mistakes. So what are we going to do about that mouth? That big mouth. You're clicking. But you're clicking down. But while this is not a soup kitchen, let's straighten that neck up and act like we're taking a photo shoot. Uh, Bucky? Yeah, you're tight in the face. Uh, exactly. Not whoa. flattering. Give it up, delicious. You look like a man. <laughs> you guys were pathetic. Wow. Oh, not mine. Okay, you just, you, you sound ignorant. You look ignorant. Bitch, I will be ignorant all over your motherfucking ass. Straight from the fucking trailer park is what you are. Did I say she was uneducated? You said ignorance. I said I'm ignorant. Yes. Excuse me. But that's not un- Well, yeah, it is. Bitch, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. You shut the fuck up with your weak ass, ass. ass. I would have to find her. And I tried to be nice to you. I really did. And I don't think it's right that you keep her. But she I insulted can, the bitch. people in the house. The best bitch is gonna win, and it's me. Right. You know, I'm the HBIC in this motherfucker. I'm not going nowhere. I'm like, didn't you just learn your lesson? You just told me that you and Delicious were great friends at one point, and you know, she fucked you over. You don't think I'm gonna do it, but even twice as hard. Girl, thank you. But I need <laughs> this stuff. She thinks that we're friends. Those are her little henchmen. Yep. Her yes men. Um, uh -huh. well, yes, the man's the boss. Oh, uh, delicious. Yes, those are what those two are. That a bitch. Well, up until this point, Bucky was, you know, dead calm in the water. But she, you know, she threw it a little bit today. She's she laid the Don't push me. Bucky almost fucking killed crazy today. And he doesn't want any corpses, you know, in his mansion. So I stepped in. I'm like, Bucky, buck down. Do not kill this girl. She totally listens to me. Crazy has no clue that this is all game. This is just New York being New York. And it's a part of my strategy. She, she, <laughs> she thinks I like her. Did I think I was going tonight? Hell fuck no. I didn't get a chance to spend time with my man. I know he was just gonna cut me and not spend one ounce of time with New York. Oh God, it's crazy right now. That mustache, that delicious, it's rocky. It's definitely thicker than flakes. And I'm a little, I'm a little disgusted by that. I don't like it. Her shit stained eye and her mustache has to go. I almost feel bad for playing her, but I don't. I mean, I'm gonna use her. She's uh, she's so fucking stupid. I'm loving you all right now. The slave. Sit tight. Oh, I'm sitting tight. 
I'm sorry, just the way they let her run this house. definition of celibacy is because that girl looks like she spreads it to the world. She's a slut. What's the matter, New York? <laughs> Nothing. Hey, New York. New York. New York. I will not sit there and basically be disrespected. I'm going to do what I want. You come back. So if I'm acting like a baby or a brat, so be it. I need my one-on-one -on -one time. And I'm gonna get it tonight. She crazy too. Mistake is wrong. What does she have? So what? Her bust line is a little bit more fuller. She has the hips and the ass. I don't need all that. You know, I have the brain power. I'm wonderful. And my frame is, you know, just great. It was just a magical night. By the end of the night, Flav took me. He needed me. Mm -hmm. I needed it. We basically took a chunk out of each other, if you will. It was a good chunk, and we chunked up the rest of the night. Oh, it's hot in here. I'm upstairs trying to get my beauty sleep, and all of a sudden, I hear this noise, and it sounds like a freaking cat is being strangled. You know, at one point, I thought my right ear was not working correctly because the shit that I heard come out of that room. I am New York. I'm fabulous. I can totally come out here with rollers in my hair and rock it. I feel great. I look great. And I'm not going anywhere tonight, so why take my rollers out? Boots knew she couldn't hold a candle to me. She's just, oh, God. It was so good to see her leave. I'm not going to attempt to her leave. I tell you to walk your ass down the hall with your shit, you're going to do so. She's my slave. I'm over her. I'm her master. Delicious totally. Gave up the room. She's such a lap dog. I have Delicious sitting in my lap. Why would she leave the room from her? Crazy's grandma, you know, she automatically assumes that Delicious' parents are from Compton Ooh. because they're black. You know, I can definitely see why Crazy's brain is the size of a squirrel. I don't know anything about kids. I never was a child. As soon as I popped out of my mom, I was just in the know. I must say, Delicious' mom, she is an innovator. I never knew in a million years that a human can sprout plastic hair. Is she from another planet? I don't know, but She's crazy so is a whore. Her mother is a whore, and her grandmother is the biggest whore I've Damn. ever seen in my life. Your daughter's with me, G. Look. Cut it out, Tiffany. What is your problem? I love her. This is fucking bullshit. <laughs> excuse my language. No, fuck it. Don't excuse it. This is bullshit. Right now, I'm screwing with the delicious. I am so powerful. My mind, oh, it amazes me sometimes. Call me a crazy-ass, psychotic, lunatic bitch from hell. I don't give a damn. I'm loving my flake, and in the end, I will have him. Whitney has Bobby. Has he gone anywhere? No. Ladies here. But he's here for me. I'm off. Um, I left my razor on the um, sink in case you want to shave your mustache while he's gone. Girl. I don't care. I don't care. I 
I know that one day that I will find a man that's truly for me, the man of my dreams, the man that's gonna give me everything and honor me. Everybody, please welcome New York. <laughs> I barely missed that. No, I was annoyed. Really. Boots, who said she had something to say. I'm going to give you a chance to speak. I sure motherfucking am. Yeah. When did you back me into a wall? I want to I wanna know that. Okay. I really want to know that because I want to see you do it. What is the suggestion on the show? That we will come right up and back into Boots? Which wall? Yeah. Okay, New York, I want to give you a chance to address what Boots said. Give you a chance to talk. Well, yes. I just want to say that I feel fabulous. I look fabulous. Boots? Was it Boots? Because I don't really remember you. You didn't really count. You don't remember me. Coming out. Are you well, you know, the show is called I Love New York. Okay. And I'm looking for true love. I'm looking for my one and only. Okay. And I feel that I'm gonna find my Chris Charming and I'm happy about this. I wanna celebrate this. You know? Okay. 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 Now, I would have had to be her ass. And they, you had all that energy at the reunion, but where was it in the house? It seemed like she was uh, bullying all y'all. And <laughs> y'all just stood there looking stupid and didn't say shit. But then you want to get buck after it's all said and done. And you hear other people saying, oh, y'all didn't do shit. Now it's like, all right, now I'm about to do something. It's too late. Um, the moments that I've seen in New York have been in, like, compilations I'm pretty sure from the first season when she said that uh, uh, that one chick, <laughs> how did she look like Luther Vandross? Those are the moments that I've seen. So these were, were a little surprising. She was really annoying. Obviously, it was entertaining to watch, but being in the house, like, I would have been irritated. Like, girl, I would beat your ass. Yo, 110 pound ass. If you don't sit the fuck down somewhere, hot mess. Anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think. Let me know what other videos you want to watch, and I'll see y'all in the next time. Bye.